programmatic is really just a way of using technology to buy and sell media. It's used in a lot of different ways, it gets associated with a lot of different things. Maybe people think it's only real-time bidding, RTB as it's called, or the open auction, or it's associated with um, remnant inventory. For us, it is a booking mechanism to sell inventory to advertisers, be it the exchange or programmatic direct or anything in between. To me, it's delivered with a set of tools or software, and RTB is a component of it, which means real-time biddable media. And at Varic Media Manager, that's the biggest piece that we use. One of the key aspects of programmatic is real-time bidding, or RTB. And that's the bit of programmatic that actually started things off. And I think it's worth taking a minute to explain what RTB, or real-time bidding, actually is. Traditionally, when you bought and sold media, you bought and sold blocks of impressions, thousands of impressions. So what happened is every visitor to, say, the Yahoo homepage saw the same ad, regardless of whether they were 50 years old and interested in luxury travel, or in their 20s and liked CrossFit. They all saw the same ad. Now what RTB does is it creates an auction environment where different marketers can bid to show a different ad to a specific user based on data about that user. As a result, now that 50-year-old interested in luxury travel might see an ad from the W Hotel and Air France, whilst the user in their 20s interested in CrossFit might see an ad from Nike and Sports Authority. In other words, RTB has the promise of delivering the right ad to the right person at the right time because we can use data to do that. Programmatic specifically is uh, on a tremendous growth rate. And we talk about it being 70, 80% growth rates for programmatic. We see that easily. Our business has grown near that, and we expect that to continue. I think as marketers embrace these new formats, uh, there becomes uh, a lot more opportunity for the industry to become smarter about it and have the dollars available to us to implement and, and, and deploy media along those lines. Uh, the technology is also moving at a much faster rate than it has in the past. I think what you've seen in the last couple of years is a change in attitudes by both buyers and sellers. Both agencies in particular and publishers have started to see that we can use the technology that is being created through real-time bidding and other aspects of programmatic to transact to create efficiencies for both buyers and sellers. There's lots of projections about N billion number of dollars being thrown into the U.S. market, which is completely true. It's a question of each publisher capturing that budget effectively and also telling the story to the user. I think 14 and beyond will be also be about the user and creative storytelling, which has been lost a bit in this tech boom. Fantastic opportunities for targeting, targeting audiences, and for efficiencies. And efficiencies about how much time and resources put into delivering media campaigns and in driving outcomes. Uh, we can drive superior outcomes given uh, all the data we have access to. One of the things that's changed over the last 12 months is the ability to use programmatic techniques to transact not just unreserved inventory, but also reserved inventory or guaranteed inventory. Things, things like programmatic direct, programmatic premium, or as the IAB's uh, terminology piece has discussed, we've talked to called about it automated guaranteed. What these tech things are is the ability to take what was a very traditional direct deal where a buyer picked up the phone and called a seller to buy all of the impressions on Yahoo homepage, for instance, that can now be transacted through a technology platform. The challenges for marketers and programmatic are basically, in the US especially, stemmed around the fact that exchanges grew up in a very direct response way, and prices were very low. And to sell a brand solution to a marketer in this climate for programmatic direct or programmatic exchange is a mind shift for them. For more information on what the IAB is doing on programmatic, you can visit www.iab.net slash programmatic.